Hey everybody, how are you guys doing? Whew. I am trying not to melt in this heat. This is pitiful. Mother Nature, I'm coming at you. Um, I have a Dollar Tree haul, so I'm just going to get into it and show you what I got. I really hope I'm not annoying because there's a lot of people that annoy me. I don't know if it's just me, you know, getting older and whatever. But yeah, I just hope I'm not annoying to anybody if, if I am. <laughs> I guess I can't help you, can I? Okay, so I found these and I got you up on my dashboard. I have you propped on a thing of tissues, the unicorn tissues, and then um, the little present box kind of thing you guys are leaning on. And you're going to hear the air conditioner because it's like 99 degrees in the car, yeah. So, barbecue, the mesquite to barbecue. I should have got the plane for my family member. Okay, hold on. Let me, let me pause this. Never, 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 never. Okay, when you go into the Dollar Tree, this is a warning. Do not, even if you're like four aisles, you know, this, this is my small one. This is a small Dollar Tree I went to. Um, because I don't know, I can stand, I can tolerate the people. The other one, they're rude. They don't talk to you. You know, they, they basically give you a look like, you know, go to you know where. Um, since everybody's in glass houses and I can't cuss, so, you know, but you know, actually, I don't even think that is a, it's not a cuss word because it's a place. But anyway, that's where they're telling you to go with their face expressions. Um, but I made the mistake of, I basically walked around four to five, if not six aisles. Um, I don't know if I'm double counting. I might be double counting them because I don't even think there's six aisles in there. There might not be. I'm not sure. But um, there could be. Anyway, but I walked around with an empty cart. Totally forgot the whole reason why I came in there is to get pizza stuff to make a pizza because I wanted it yesterday. But then, you know, we just didn't do it. So, I literally mentally sat there and said to myself looking at my empty buggy that I'm pushing around well it was kind of holding me up too because then my hip wanted to act stupid halfway through um I was like there's nothing in your cart Kim and I don't know what else I said what else did I say there's nothing in my cart you know this is stupid pushing a buggy around they don't have anything you know yada 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 Okay, well, probably right after I said that, I'm heading out of the aisle, and lo and behold, let me show you what I found. These probably won't even work on my door, but I found this. This is what started it all. This is probably the first thing that went into my buggy, if I remember correctly. I got this one with the, um, the mermaid design, and then I really like this one on my scarf. So I got this one. Now, if these don't work on your door, because see how they have that, that's supposed to go over your door. If they don't work and, and let your door close, you can always put them on. I have um, that black one that I have. Well, that goes, hangs on the wall. It's got the four, the four um, hooks. I'm like, what the heck are they called? And I have mine sitting on, I'll have to show you guys. That'd be like a short video because um, my room is a hot mess. But anyway, so, so is my life. So, I have mine sitting on the shelf. Yeah, because it does have the hooks, I think. And then um, I have a container sitting on top of it that's heavy enough. And it's actually, you know, in there really good, you know, because, of course, it's like over the metal of the wire shelf. And so, if that doesn't work, then you guys could do that for these. You know, find a purpose. You know, don't be like, oh, dag, they don't work. And, you know, so anyway, so I got those. Then it all went to heck in a handbasket. I have two bags. I mean, to start out having nothing in my buggy, you know, walking around with my empty buggy, and then daggone it, I say that, you know, oh, there's nothing in here, and I said all this trash, and Dollar Tree's like, you know what, let me show you something. Yeah. Okay, everybody is raving about these, so I went ahead and got these. I have, I have wipes, you know, at home. I get them from Sam's Club in the big old, in the big old box, because sometimes toilet paper just doesn't cut it. I know TMI, but... And we have good, oh, dag, they smell good. Dag on it. My other ones are plain. I mean, they're, <laughs> they're, they're unscented, but these have a nice smell. I got these because I wanted, oh yeah, shea butter. <laughs> really? I'm not going to use these on my stamps. I'm going to use these on my body. So anyway, now I, I was, I did buy these for my stamps though, but why do I want to put shea butter on my stamps? You know what I'm saying? My body deserves shea butter. Lord help us. Okay. I got these because I needed Q-tips, 
And then I was watching Lisa Twyla's mom. Twyla's mom, that is her channel, so go check her out. She's doing all kinds of um, Halloween um, uh, crap, Halloween crafts. And um, she took like a gum case. See, these are in cases if you guys can't really tell. Uh-oh, there you go. My container just gave up on me here. Hold on, y'all. Let me see. Or my tissues. Let me just put you down here. Oh, crap. We're in trouble now. Okay, I'll hold you. Whoop. Shoot. Hold on, let me pause this. <sighs> okay, you're farther away, but the Pringles is holding you up now. This is what you guys were leaning on. I had bought this for a uh, birthday gift, and it didn't work, so. And then th you were sitting on my tissues. Okay. I really got to clean up my car. Where was I? I don't even know where I was. Okay, I found this lonesome thing. Don't even ask me what I'm going to do with it. But I found this lonesome uh, table mat, fabric placemat. I love the design, so I might put it in like my shelf, or maybe sit it in a drawer, or maybe sit it on top of my uh, cabinet. Oh, this is what we're talking about. Okay, well, see, I forgot. Okay, so um, Lisa is making like things out of the, the gum. I think it's the extra gum, and it comes in a case. She's making like little Halloween... Um, things sorry for the alms that's what I do when my brain has no words so I thought oh these are in cases so when I get done using them maybe I could you know decorate this not like Halloween but just decorate it you know whatever because I thought that was a cool idea of hers you know take your containers and and you know jazz them up so I got those showed you the placemat I wanted this you know I'm, I'm using yeah I was gonna take my keys because my car is running but this is my dirty old Mickey Mouse lanyard that I probably either got from Five Below or or where did I get it? Let me turn this down in case it's loud um, or louder. But so I got this corded lanyard. You know, what do they call it? Yeah, lanyard, cordon. So anyway, oh, and it has a safety. Oh, look at that, a safety thing. So now I can lose my keys. I don't know where the heck the film thing is. Okay. I went ahead, I wasn't going to get this. This is this might have been the first thing. This is probably like the first and sad little pitiful thing I had in my cart. I think so. And so this bends down. I'm going to, I don't know, I like the design of it. It just reminded me of my family member who isn't here. And so I'm going to try, Lord help me, find a place in my room. And just six, because I, I, um, I don't know who said it. I think it was, oh, I, oh my gosh, her channel names, uh, if I think of her, but she had hauled these and said about not putting heavy things. What is her channel? It's like, I don't know, it's bouncing around in my head, but not to put heavy things on this because like, especially candles and stuff, because especially lit candles, because this will um, fall down. Okay. Long story for that. I'm trying to think of her name though. That really annoys me because I like to, you know, I like to you know give people the creditation or whatever I got um, my pizza it would have been you know what and I probably look at my face it probably would have been like me to sit there and and just buy this stuff and forget about the pizza stuff and then either have to go back or just because I have lunch I have leftovers to eat so I can't even get a candy bar I would have got crunch bars but I didn't see that they had any them things are like extinct around here I love crunch bars and like when when people have like those donation not donations but when they have like those candy the candy bar they're just the candy bar fundraiser drives I love to get the crunch bars oh my gosh they're so good okay I got two boxes of these pepperonis let me tell you guys something sorry the video is gonna be long um, but I haven't done one in a while so whatever <laughs> um, take your pep take your um, what is that called? Take your crust, right? If you don't know about this, because I discovered it and it's dag blasted good. Um, put your sauce down, then put a layer of pepperonis down. This whole stinking box, you know, put it on there. And then put your cheese and then add another layer of pepperonis. Holy heck, Batman. Whoo! It is so, 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 so good. Eric gets mad because I'm like, how am I going to fit all these pepperonis on there? He's like, well, give them to me. I'll eat them. And I'm like, no, they got to go. They got to go on the pizza. Here is my cheese that I buy, the Figaro cheese. Where is the lens on my phone? I love this stuff. It melts. It is delicious. It is awesome. I mean, it's probably not worth the value to buy three, but you know what? I don't feel like going to the store. 
Okay, now all these, nope, they're not all the same. Okay, check this out, y'all. Oh, Lord have mercy. I'm not even going to get on this kick. You know what I'm going to tell you? There's a lady that on one of the Dollar Tree groups, I think it's just the one called Dollar Tree Halls, you know, where all the women act like two-year-olds, apparently. I miss it all. I miss all the drama. But I got an L, and I'm going to take this L, and I'm going to try to take one of my saws that I have and try to, like, make this mark right here and just try to bring it down like that and make myself an eye. <laughs> so I'm going to use the L to make an eye. So, but anyway, so the woman on there said that, um, what did she say? The woman on there said she must have ordered these and she, she showed the picture of the letters that you get because apparently there's some letters missing. So I was like, I was like, what? No, I, and I put, you know, lowercase I, cause usually on my phone, it looks like an L or something. It doesn't look like an I, but, um, and then I put, what's wrong with you, Dollar Tree, or something like that. Girlfriend came back, and she was like, it's the manufacturer's fault. And I'm thinking, Dad, take a joke, woman. Take a joke. Anyway, so that's my eye. And then I was super excited to find these. I got, um, I think I just got one of these. Can you guys see? The Flamingo stickers. And these are called Glitter Fancy Sheets. These are 12 count in those. I got, oh crap. Okay, I got two of these because I just thought they were cool as Hades. These, I think they all have 12. Nope, some of them have more. Oops, sorry. Not even in the frame. Can y'all see them? Get my finger out the way. So I got two of those. I got one of just the pineapple. There's 12. There's only 10 unicorns. Now I'm wishing I got two of these. And then, you know, because I do like Bible journaling and different things. And so then I got two of these only because they have like little words and little sayings on them. So I thought if I wanted to make myself something, there's my second one. And then I got two of the mermaids. Oh, and then these unicorn ones had 18. And then the, you know, the, the, the mermaids have 16. So there you go. And they have like little like little words and stuff on them too, a little bit. Okay, and then, I don't even know. I, I'm assuming this is all I got. Okay, oh, let me, cause the last thing, I got this color, but I really don't know, I know, I don't even wear it, but anyway, I got this color. I had an ugly day yesterday, I really, I really felt ugly. I'm not the type of person, you know, that wakes up in the mirror. I mean, wakes up in the mirror. Wakes up and looks in the mirror and be like, oh, you're so pretty. You're so yeah, yeah. No, I don't have those moments um, at all. But I don't know. Yeah, I don't think this is the color that I wanted. So there you go. These were very, like, spoken for. So, and this is by City Color B Matte Lipstick. So, yeah, I like the ones you know, that are like frosted, I guess the ones that you're not supposed to like, but okay. Hopefully I, okay. Basically I, I love cute things. I know I'm 43 years old. I turned 43 July, Lord help me. And, um, what was I going to say? Is that a dead bird? Hopefully that's a piece of mulch. Anyway. Um, yes. And I have ADD. I get distracted. And I forget what I'm saying. Woo. Um, <laughs> Just so y'all, I mean, if y'all haven't figured it out already. Um, yes. What is in this bag? I bought myself a set. Not going to lie. My sister, I have two sisters that by my birth mother had. So we share the same mother. I have another sister. We share the same father. Okay. So my two sisters that live um, far away, like eight, nine hours. I have never talked to them. It's been... You know what? I bet you in the middle of September, sorry if I'm getting loud, the middle of September, it would have been three years maybe, and I have not spoken to them. I have not called them on the phone. I have not, um, they have not like wanted to video chat or whatever all that crap is you can do on your phone. Nothing. The one sister has um, a 12, he might be 13 now, 12 year old son. She went through a miscarriage. Um, probably, I don't know. Anyway, she went through a miscarriage after 12 years of having, 12 years have, I think it was 11 or 12 years of having her son. 
So she hasn't had a baby. Well, then she got pregnant. Okay, put it that way. And then I don't know how long and then she miscarried. Okay, well then magically she has, she's pregnant again. Okay, she delivers that baby full term. Woohoo. Um, still haven't talked to her. And now when she was pregnant, I don't know what the heck happened, but I think she basically has erased me from her life. Anyway, long story. And then the other one, I don't talk to her. She's the youngest. I'm the oldest of all of them, even the brother. There's a brother in the picture too, but I don't talk to him ever. Um, that's in a whole nother ballpark. I know, where's Dr. Phil when you need him? Um, and so my other sister, the youngest one, has two. She had a boy, and then she had a girl. I think the girl is one or maybe a little bit. Okay, so anyway. So, I know, long story, right? Anyway, even though, I mean, it's hard because I can't blame the stuff on the kids. You know, yes, I mean, by law, you know, by blood, they're my niece and nephew. I don't know them. They probably don't even know me. They don't even probably know that they have an Aunt Kim, which really freaking sucks. But anyway, so I bought these for myself. There's Grover. I think this is Zoe. There, I was told, not I was told, but I read that there was five in a set. I bought, um, oh my gosh, I know Elmo. There's Elmo, Oscar, and Cookie Monster. Okay, so I had bought all of these for myself, and I'm like, Kim, I'm like, I my favorite was Cookie Monster. My favorite. Loved him. Now, there was only two sets, because then I got another set for my, for my one sister, because, you know, since the other one still has, you know, the other one is just like you know, the, you know, the baby, the infant. So he can't play with those. But, um, my other sister, her son, I think is like two or three years old. He can play with them and my niece can play with them. And I got to thinking and I'm like, you know what, Kim, I might actually go back in there. They'll just love seeing me again. But I think I might go in there and get myself Oscar and Cookie Monster while they have them because I love Oscar and Cookie Monster. I love them. Um, and I might get some more wipes. I don't know. But, yeah, I just, um, but I think that I'm going to give one set to my, well, I'm going to give one set to both of my sisters, you know, um, my niece and nephew, they'll have to share, and then, um, you know, the other one will have them. She did accept, you know, my other stuff, because when I did have her gift and everything, I sent it to her, and I mean, she did accept it, but I haven't seen her, like, use anything or talk about it. It's, it's really funny, though, because you know how there's a lot of people who are like, you know, they're raving over the, the baby things like the, um, the wipes and the bibs and all that. And I sent her all those and, you know, I really didn't get a reaction like, Oh, this is great. Or, you know, woohoo or, you know, anything. It's just like, okay. So, but you know, it's me. It's a thought that counts. I mean, there was a lot, there's a lot of, uh, sorry y'all. There's a lot of, uh, tag on it. I'm, okay. There we go. There's, mm, there is a lot of, you know, bigger YouTubers. I mean, I don't know what I am, but I'm just a person. But there's, you know, big YouTubers out there that have like, you know, that have the button, the YouTube button and all that. That's how big they are. Okay, well, they love those, you know, the, the little baby washcloths that they had and the plastic bibs and um, what was the other cool thing? Like the little mitts and stuff. So I don't know. That's what I got her. I don't know where I'm looking. I'm probably looking over this way or something. It looks like it. But anyway, and there's a mosquito like trying to get in here. So I'm going to go guys. Um, I guess this about 19 minutes makes up for me not being on here, but, um, yeah, I just don't know what to do. You know, with the, with the, all three of my sisters, actually, I'm always the one, like they don't talk to me. I must be like a, a poopy sister or something, but, um, I know I can't blame it on myself, but I'm always the one, you know, messaging them. I'm always the one, you know, texting. I don't talk. I don't call nobody. I got burnt out with doing that years ago, years and years and years ago. You know, you'd call somebody and they, you know, you think that they could talk and next thing you know, five minutes later, you know, they're like, oh, I got to go. You know, I got to poop. I got to do laundry. I'm like, seriously? I'm like, then why didn't you tell me, you know, five minutes ago? But anyway, now I can run in here and get a candy bar too. Like I need it. <laughs> but anyway, y'all, I hope you have a good one. Um, what is today? Today's Thursday. Yep, today's Thursday. So hopefully when I go in there, they have an Oscar and a and a uh, cookie monster. I'm going to be a little mad and I got to hurry up because my cheese is going to melt up in here. 
because it's hot. It's still 99. I'm in the shade on the side of the building, which you guys can't see. You guys just see the back. But anyway, y'all, it's been real. So, and if you've seen what I haul, then I can't help you. Oh, 20 minutes now. This is going to take a long time to upload. But anyway, let me go for this thing cuts off. I hope you guys have a great Thursday. Have a great Friday. Have a great weekend. I don't know if I'll be back. I really, I mean, the stuff I'm getting in the mail, I don't think my mail hauls or mail haul was really, you know, great. Or I don't know if it got a lot of views or, you know, whatever. I think I'm just really wasting my time doing this. But anyway, it's fun to talk to some of you guys that like to talk and chat. So... If you guys want to hit me up on my Facebook, hit me up on my Facebook. So, you know, that way we can, like, message and, you know, talk and whatever. And I can send you those, what do you call them things, those GIF things? Oh, my gosh. I know my one friend's going to kill me because I keep sending them to her. <laughs> They're funny, though. They crack me up. But anyway, y'all, it's been real. Have a good one. Subscribe if you want. Hit the bell if you want to know when my crazy self is coming on. And I will see you when I see you. Alrighty, bye.